This year I wrote about a, a really amazing emerging technology which could help uh, restore motion to paralyzed people. It goes by different names. One of them is a neural bypass and it's, uh, it's pretty incredible stuff. <laughs> You may have heard there's experiments where people get a probe put in their brain, uh, it reads their thoughts, and they can control a robot arm or maybe a cursor on a computer screen. But what's happening now is that scientists are connecting uh, that brain probe to electrodes in people's arms or legs and allowing them to move their limbs again using their thoughts. These injuries are just devastating. And so anything that can be done to help people uh, restore even simple motions, like raising your hand to your mouth to grab a a cup of water uh, would make a huge difference. And although the results are dramatic, the experiments are super interesting, it's quite hard to bring it all together in a system that would actually be useful in the real world. So I'm saying it's still 10 or 15 years away. <laughs>